trust. Welcome into News Channel 11 at 5. I'm Casey Marler. And I'm Sarah Diamond. With power bills rising due to recent inclement weather, it hasn't been easy for many residents of the region to keep up with the price increase. News Channel 11's Leah Johnson has information on how people in Greene County can receive assistance with their utility bills. Residents across the region are feeling the effects of the winter weather, and they are seeing that in the increase of their power bills. We help with electric bills, we help with water bills, food is the main thing, and electricity. During the winter months, utility bills will increase, but there are some things you can do to try and keep the cost low. Moderate the temperature on your thermostat, try to keep it 65 to no more than 68 degrees. Um, insulation, try to get all the drafts around your windows and your doors. But for those who can't afford the cost of their utilities, there are resources within the community. We have the Roundup program that uh, where customers round their payment up to the next dollar and, and we match some of those funds and that goes to the food bank and typically there's between fourteen and fifteen thousand dollars a month that goes over there to be uh, given to customers in need. What we do with the Greenville Light and Power system, regardless, is that with their help and uh, another source, if they have children, then they can get a total of uh, toward electric bill four times in a year. Although there is a limit on how much money a person can receive, every little bit counts. They usually give 200 there's a lot of them that's under 200 and they get a full amount. But if it's over 200, they usually come up with the rest of it on their own and we will give them 200. If you are seeking assistance with your utility bills, you can stop by the Greenville Green County Community Ministries Food Bank from 9 a.m. to 12 p.m. Monday through Fridays. In Greenville, Leah Johnson, News Channel 11. If you're looking for help but don't live in Greene County, the Upper East Tennessee Human Development Agency has neighborhood service centers located all over the region. Here you can see they have nine different locations from Bristol to Greenville. If you're in Northeast Tennessee, there should be one near you. And for those interested to receive assistance, you have to apply. And when applying, you will need a government issued identification and proof of gross income for everyone in your household. It's important to know that funding can take between 60 and 90 days.